Chesna, not a mo moment too soon. The skies over Gullermall were ablaze, but it's events on the ground that concern me. As you will have heard, your fellow scions arrived ahead of you. We cut the customary greetings short after we received word from our troops on the Magna Glacier, or Glacies, that the form's airship had landed. It was then that the heavens began to burn. I dispatched your friends at once to ensure the refugees come to no harm. I would have you join them immediately, alright? Let's proceed. Earlier, let's see what happened. Oh, gosh. Jeez. No. 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 We were promised an escape. Not the same moon we fled. No. Oh. Fortunate? I shall not meet my final days here in this blasted waste. Oh, no. Calm yourselves. Your panic is our greatest enemy. You Come, suit up? we must build a line of defense. How? Leave the fighting to us, father. You must lead the people to safety. Yes, Dinian. Easy. <laughs> no, that one doesn't look too easy. I can handle this pair. You shall tend to the refugees. Let us be about it. Teamwork. Let's go. <laughs> oh gosh, I As hope you nothing. Wish, my little lord. I hope nothing happens to Astinian. Oh gosh, am I gonna be Astinian or the little one, Alphino? Oh, of course. Jeez, what is this? Stores HP. I'll command the beast's zone. attention. See to the wounded. Stores target HP. Okay. Help is at hand. Uh, stores target HP. They all. Okay. Sustinian. Oh shit. Don't y'all don't freak out. Don't freak out. Alright. Come on. Those who can stand, come with me! Uh. 
Easy now. Deep breaths. Yes, please, deep breaths. You too. You're safe now. Don't freak out. Denny is Worry just not for the refugees, but for yourself. There's the Stinian. Where are we going? Oh, what the hell is that? not in my party. That's what's wrong. Woo! Could it be in a healer? I didn't look yet. Yeah, dragons are not meant to be uh, tanks. Keep coming, don't they? Looks like he needs a, uh... Oh gosh. Forward! Let not a single fiend escape! <gasps> oh, it's the blue-haired guy. Isn't it? Wait, that's... Euless and the army. So, Eulis. you've recovered then? In time enough to be of aid, for once. Sweet, we got Magitek on our side. We can speak of it more later. For now, we must fight! Hell yeah, let's go. To repay your salvation in kind, or with <sighs> better! 
for Garlemald has her pride! Of that I've no doubt. Yeah. Saviors, the Imperial Army. Beggars can't be choosers. Oh. I had hoped to take all of them down at once. Think a withdrawal might be in order? Oh, sod that. <laughs> you know who would never abandon these people to their fate? To be devoured by their former friends. That'll be beyond cruel. These beasts must fall here and now. Well then, I'd say it's high time we threw caution to the winds. <laughs> Grah. So long as you spare me the heroic sacrifices. Right? Now, None of that. Let's go. We don't need any more of that from you, Graha. My Alice? Oh, I am. Okay. I've never been a red mage before. Um, execute following actions in succession. Okay. An attack with potency of 400. Restores your target's HP. Increase his own magic damage dealt by 5% of damage dealt by nearly. Okay. So these are all those 200 to all. Oh, okay, that's my AOE. Okay. Well, let's do this then. Oh, this is a cast. Okay. Isn't too bad. Okay. There's my AoE. Gotta heal myself. Alright. myself again. I'm fine. Boom. If I don't continue with the sword, it has like a big cooldown on it, it looks like. Oh, I need to do this one.
None to worry about. The air crackles with energy. Find cover! Fair play. On guard. Yeah. Boom. Done. Thank you, Groha, for healing me. There's an ugly. Not the barest trace of ether. Maybe there really is no way to bring them back. Probably not. Thank you for saving our lives once again. I remember you, from Purusha. You helped us there too, didn't you? Ah, oh, you're from Palakar Stand. I'm glad you're still in one piece. Oh, you will be, once I see to that injury of yours. Look out! Now what? Oh, that reminds me of the trailer. <laughs> yep. In comes Alphano, right? Or me, really. Oh, Graha. Get out of here! Quickly! I won't lose them. Not a one. This will be a brighter future. Oh, girl, huh? I won't let a madman's apocalypse ruin everything we've fought to achieve. Yeah, bitch. Get wrecked. Get him, girl. Huh? <laughs> Get it together, Alize. You're embarrassing yourself! And in front of father, no less. Where's father? I don't see him. You might never measure up to our champion. But we ask too much of her as it is. You mustn't let Eorzea's hero fight alone. Speaking of which... I'm just gonna walk in? Are you serious? I would be running in. Like hell on heels. Dragoon oh. jumping everywhere. Just. This is precisely why you should never skip your squat wretchedly. <laughs> You've done well in my absence, but now it's time for me to get back in action. Hmm. I can look after myself, you know. Oh yeah, I know. Everything's in order, I trust? Yeah. Oh, another one? I've had enough of this rabble! Come on! Alright. Oh, a trio for the ages! 
Absolutely, Graha. A trio for the ages. See if this dude does anything different. Just the beginning. Oh, what's you. up, Estinian? Alright, should we start counting this orcs the <laughs> that we like killed? <laughs> oh, I'm with you. Let's see here. Ooh, that eye is nasty. What the hell is this? Got it. You must board without delay. The ship will depart ere long. Your offer to host us in Charlian is most appreciated. But will the final days not soon fall upon it as well? 
Your hesitation is not unwarranted. The Satrap entrusted me with your lives, yet I have failed your comrades. Nor are you wrong to fear that this corruption will continue to spread. I cannot promise you complete safety, even in my homeland. <clears throat> what I can promise is that I will do all in my power to protect you. That power is not inconsiderable. Even now, my countrymen are preparing the vessel that will deliver us to a sanctuary on the moon. Join us on our journey there and beyond to new horizons. Come to old Charlian, please. We would be fools to refuse such a generous offer made in earnest. Mm -hmm. It seems they've a new destination. The people of Radzat Han have known too much suffering. The march to Garlemald will only bring them more, short though it may be. I quite agree. Fortunately, they have you to look after them. Oh. Yes. Well. That was sweet. Behind you! Just there! Oh, what else? What else could come at me? What else? This isn't gonna be too good. More of them. Yeah, exactly. More of them. Was that Z Oh, what's up, dude? Are you with us or against us now? Oh shit. Xenos. Oh. Here. Yeah, exactly here. What the fuck? <laughs> I thought he was hiding. You'll be all right. Hurry to the airship. Xenos, we need to like sit down and have a huge heart to heart because the entire planet's being destroyed here. I think we can maybe, you know, cast aside our differences for now. Maybe. Hopefully. Maybe. Why have you come? A heretofore unseen beast. Twas ripe for the slaying. Yes. Poor sport, alas. Unfit to temper my blade. Oh, for the love of... You cannot still be on about a rematch. <laughs> I know, Alice. It's just how he is. It's just how he is. Um, but let's hear him out. That is and has ever been my sole concern. You, on the other hand, are fixated on a different quarry. Tell you what, you help me with my quarry, and we can have a rematch afterwards. How about that? Good? Your passion pales before mine. Yet neither hate nor despair seems sufficient to recapture your misdirected bloodlust. Oh, can we call it bloodlust, though? I So, I hone my blade, and I wait. You wanna... Well, I mean, at least he's slaying these beasts. It's a start. <laughs> That's it. That's all you care about. No, oh, no, Julius. That sucks, because, like, he is the prince. You know? Garlemald is in ruins. Our homeland 
The nation you rule is as good as gone. Like, easy, but yeah, speak some sense to him because maybe it takes a Garlean, Garlean to talk to a Garlean. I don't know. It's worth a shot. Along with so many of its people. Yes. Not just soldiers like us. Not only those who fought and killed for power and duty. Innocent civilians. Come on, Prince of Garlemald. You just gonna let let these beasts kill your people? Come on. Murdered by their own flesh and blood. Lost and confused as they breathed their last. While we who survived with our lives and minds intact were left to freeze to death. The Eorzeans tell me all this was your doing. Oh God. You slaughtered your countrymen. You did. For what? Yeah, for what? For nothing in the end. So much wasted effort. <sighs> well, there goes that. You. You bastard! Don't, don't, For your don't. Sake, Eulis, you must control your anger. Yes, please. We don't need you turning to, and you really don't need to run at Xenos because he's just gonna hack you down. It will serve no one should it consume you and see you transformed. Exactly. <laughs> Can't I talk to him? He's the one I... I mean, I'm the one he wants. Would you be happier had I a good reason? Not really. Because in the end, they're still gone. What? If my motives met with your approval, would you no longer resent the outcome? If so, then perhaps a beast's skin would suit you better. Harsh. Duty, honor, morality. All constructs of convenience when put to proof. Surely the war taught you how easily power becomes the tool of the self-righteous. How the people's justice was merely a means to their ends? Yet you would ask me why. Ask any creature of this star and those above for answers, and they will tell you what suits their fancy. And they would be right to do so. What meaning there is to be found in the petty vicissitudes of your existence must be gleaned by you and you alone. Should you seek it in battle in the fruitless pursuit of my demise, then come. Assume your rightful place as a notch on my blade. Oh, gosh. Don't. Somebody hold him back. Somebody grab him. You... Mm -mm, don't do it. You are a blight on the Garlean race. And there would be no more satisfying way to expunge it than by beating you to death. But I will not be party to another tragedy. I refuse to lose anyone else because of you. So go. Go! And may we never suffer your madness again! Xenos! Uh... Perhaps you found meaning in living this way. I cannot deny you found strength. 
Yet if you only pursue your hedonistic pleasures and pay no heed to the plight of others, then no one will give you the time of day. I mean, you kind of have to... I mean, he's a prince. He's never wanted for anything. So, you know, that doesn't excuse him. But someone needs to tell him, like Alizé. <laughs> you will never get what you want. Not even the battle you pine for so dearly. You'll be alone for an eternity, and you'll deserve every agonizing second of it. Am I not going to speak at all? Jeez. I could have said what Alizé said. That would have been a little bit more meaningful, I feel like. We're ready to depart. The refugee ships will be leaving shortly, but I've asked <sighs> mine to remain for the time being. There's room enough for you to join me on it, if you wish. Do contain your surprise. I needn't agree with the Scion's methods or intentions to acknowledge that their deeds are deserving of gratitude. We appreciate the offer. But might I ask why you are delaying your departure? I presume it is not solely for our benefit. I must visit Garlemald ere we return to Charlion. Having caused such an uproar, it is only meet that I explain myself to the Ilzabad contingent. Oh. Allow us to accompany you then. We should be glad to facilitate, given our familiarity with all concerned. If you would like to join as well, Eulus, we can speak of recent events on the way. I want him to be like the new prince of Garlemald. He'll be off to your seat on the forum next. Foot. <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, you have another son you don't know about. His name's Astinian. <laughs> you might as well just you. Know. Are we going to see more of Xenos? Who knows? Well, that was interesting. Whew. That encounter with Xenos, though, I felt like could have gone a little bit better. Like, in a way, I feel bad for him. In another way, it's like, you're a psycho. So, that was good. Maybe, uh, maybe we'll see him again. Maybe we can, like, I mean, he's done atrocious things, but he would be a very powerful ally. I mean, the entire planet's being destroyed, so, uh, I don't know. It'll be interesting. It'll be interesting to see where they take Xenos, because they could take him... I mean, mostly to, to the darkness. I mean, that's basically, you know, the bad guy thing, you know. Oh, I'm, I'm going to go toward the darkness. I'm going to be one with the darkness. And But, you, you know, you don't ever know. He could... I hate to say a redemption story because redeeming what he's done is not possible. 
but maybe understanding and knowing what Alizé just told him is what his future's looking like. So maybe he'll correct his course. I don't know. It will be interesting. <laughs>